So we like to put on the neurons afterwards because that's a way for us to make sure that all the neurons are in the right place. And that way we expose also the neurons a decent amount of time to any types of magnetic field. So here we go, putting placing the neurons. Again, here I can maybe tighten this up, make some adjustments. This is the most important um, sensor on the body because this is the kind of the center point from which when you're doing the full body capture, all the other sensors are based on. This needs to be on the lower back, okay? Now there's additional straps in the kits that allow you to run this between your legs and keep it more stable. We, su we strongly suggest you use those to make the, this as stable as possible on the lower back. So when you start putting the, the neurons on the glove, you'll notice that the uh, connectors on the hand are made out of rubber and they're different. They don't clip in like the other ones. They're made out of rubber, so you won't hear the clicking sound. So for those, you just have to make sure they seat in well. And you'll kind of feel they just kind of like sit, not really flush with the top of the connector. They seat just slightly above but you'll get a feel for it. They, they sit securely inside. And you'll notice here I'm putting them in every single slot because we want to show you really the full setup here. Let's see, this is the 32 kit and I am down to just one extra one, which would, that would be for my prop, which we're not using today. So now I just want to do a, a double check on my mocap subject, make sure everything is nicely tight. The less movement there are with your sensor, the better the capture.